Hello guys, in this video you are going to learn how to configure DHCP using server. Let's build network topology where it contains one router, two switches, two server, PC and laptops. Let's connect this. I'm gonna name this server as DHCP server. Let's also name this server as DHCP server 2. So let's configure this DHCP server. Open the desktop, give IP configuration of this. So I'm gonna name 10.10.10.1 subnet mask, default gateway 10.10.0 and go to the service tab. Under service tab, go to DHCP, click on service, leave the pool name as it is and give the default gateway as 10.10.0. If you want DNS, you can also give that. So I'll name it as 10.10.4. So IP starts from 10 and also subnet mask, leave as it is and save this. Close this. Open up this DHCP server 2. Go to desktop, IP configuration, give IP for address as 20.20.1, default gateway as 20.20.0. Go to service tab, DHCP, click on service on, give default gateway as 20.20.0, DNS server, I'll give it as 4. Let's give IP address range from 20. If you want different, you can give it, save this, close this and let's configure router here so this LAN is connected to this router through fast ethernet 0 slash 0 so open this router config tab under interface section go to fast ethernet 0 slash 0 click on port status on give ip4 address that is 10.10.10.0 .10 .10 that is a default gateway address give subnet mask close this so this second LAN is connected to the router through fast ethernet 1 slash 0 open up the router under config tab go to fast ethernet 1 slash 0 port status on give ip4 address as default gateway address that is 20.20.0 subnet mask close this so now let's configure the pcs and laptops open up the pc desktop ip configuration so it's in static mode click on dhcp it's requesting ipv4 address DHCP request is successful. Close this. So open up this laptop. Come to desktop, IP configuration. Click on DHCP. Now it's also successful. Close this. Let's send packets. PC to server. Successful. From this laptop to this server. Also successful. Let's send packets from PC to laptop. For the first time it will be failed, do it again. And also for the server, first time it's also failed. Now it's successful. Thank you for watching guys.